My name is Johan Falk. I'm a math and physics teacher in Stockholm, Sweden. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to use spreadsheet actions to grant view access to folders. Uh, in some previous video, I created these folders using student actions, and now I'm going to uh, allow students to view their own folders. Uh, this is the uh, sheet I'm working with right now. I have a column for student folders, and I also entered a column for uh, the link to student folders. Kind of useful. And in the previous video, I downloaded and installed the file access plugin. And now I'm going to uh, edit some options here, and then I'm going to grant view access to this folder. Okay, so we can see that this uh, plugin uses some uh, options in other plugins, such as the file management options, source file ID and source folder ID. Source folder ID is uh, used for granting access to folders. And down here we also have um, uh, which, um, which uh, accesses to grant and I want to uh, grant view access, so this is set to true, and this is edit access set to false, and comment access is set to false. Comment access is not really used for folders, but anyway. Uh, down here, some other options we're not using uh, right now. So, uh, da -da -da -da. let's have a look at the source folder setting in uh, uh, file management plugin as well. So I'm opening file management. It's actually already open here. Source folder column says four. What is the number of my column here? It's four. So that's good. Okay. So now everything in column four, the folders here will be granted view, well, will be used to uh, give you access to students. And the Google ID is as before in column 3. So I'm just gonna run a bulk action here, grant access access to folders, run. I'm actually not sure that these Google IDs exist, but it seems to be working fine. Yep, good. And now I can select a folder. And it says not shared uh, because maybe this email address didn't exist. After all, okay, but this folder, this, uh, okay, so explain, I try to explain what's going on here. These are just phony uh, um, email addresses. These Google IDs do not really exist, so the sharing of these files, Alice, Bob, and John Doe, didn't really work. But this address exists, it's mine, so this is shared, uh, and I get to view this, not edit, just as I want. And that's how to do that for a whole class in one click or so. I uh, hope you enjoy this. In the upcoming videos, we're going to look at how to create student workbooks. And No, we're actually first going to see how to copy uh, files into these folders. See you in another video. Bye.